Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Brian, your host and commentator, and welcome back to Fallout 4. Let's go ahead and make our way over here to the Red Rocket station. Red Rocket, isn't that a dog's dick when it has an erection or something? Something nasty like that? I don't know, South Park did a whole episode about it. Greet the dog. Oh, hey, doggy wogie. What? Hey, what is it? What are you doing out here all by yourself? Yeah, in the rain. You lose your owner, buddy. Okay, then. Let's stick together. So this is your first companion dog. That's really cool. I like it. It's a good first companion. Dog found something. Yeah, so he'll alert you to certain things. Where'd he go? I have no idea where he went, dog. Oh, wait. Oh, he's over here. Pre-war money. I want that. Telephone. This is another like workshop area. See, it has the power armor machine. You know, workshop, weapons workbench. Oh shit. Oh no, we're under attack. More rats. She's my critical. And this is a critical. Yeah, so you like, it's weird. You save your critical hits or whatever. It's, I don't know. I don't quite understand. It's cool though. Because it kind of lets you, I don't know, it, give you, it gives you sort of like a, a mana pool, you know, in a weird way. Ah, oh, I missed. I don't have that. I think you can hurt your companions too, so you want to look out for that. Take the teeth and the hide. Research test tube. Okay. Alright, I think that's teeth. I teeth. Um, yeah, whatever. Alright, let's explore the rest of this area. Those can be used as parts. Toaster. Ham radio. Nothing. Wow. Place is just so desolate. Pencil, knife, buff out. Desk. Ooh, caps. Better clipboard. Wait, don't worry, man. I plan on heading back to uh, Sanctuary to drop off a bunch of stuff. <clears throat> oh. Excuse me. I'm drinking beer right now, too, so I'm a little gassy. So basically, if you read these, you learn about um, customers and stuff that they're doing, like helping out. And then uh, they also mention a cave underneath the gas station that allows, that has like a little, allows you to, has like a, I don't know, a whole hidden area, you know? It's like a whole little area. And that's where they were dumping waste, and that's why they were passing inspections so well or something like that. Like they were doing really well on inspections. Here's a chem station kinds of shit. And there's the, what's this, the, the armor workbench. And here's the cooking station, yeah. If you transfer stuff here, then all those items stay here. I want to have them all together, so that's why I'm only going to transfer them in Sanctuary. Extinguisher, I will fucking take all those. Alright, let's go in here. Mole rat den. No wonder those mole rats were disturbed and why they attacked. These assholes have been... Poisoning them. You can pick those mushrooms off the wall. I'm not going to worry about it, though. Ooh. I 
got this. There's like an explosive container over here somewhere. Oh shit. Wow. Popped him right behind me. I was just like, oh my god. Shot the shit out of him. Alright. So, radiation over here. Is there anything good? Fusion core. There we go. We want that. So you want to get fusion cores. That's what powers uh, power armor. If you don't have fusion cores, you cannot use power armor. Let's make that a note. Get the cherry. Actually, I'm going to need that carrot later. Yeah, save any vegetables you get. Because you can use them to grow crops. Which is needed later. After we uh, leave Concord. That's about as far as I've gotten so far. Obviously, I'm going to play ahead and figure out what's going on. But, um... I don't know. I'm just going to take time for that. Did I get them all three? Boom! All three. Look at that. Sit your rabid mole ass down. Rabid mole rat ass down. Or whatever. All right, I'm gonna save that safe for last. Let's grab all these. Coffee cup, sure. Use oil can, sure. Um, water, don't need any of that. Was that an ex? Did you see an extinguisher? Maybe not. Okay, is that all the junk? Yeah. Okay, cool. Let's unlock the safe. There's gonna be some goodies in here. Sweet. Buff out. Ugh, I don't even fuck with the the mines. I don't like fucking with them. Facking with them. Although they are worth 50 caps. I'll probably get a decent penny next time I see a trader. Which I think the first one you see is when you're leaving Concord. At least that's the first time I saw one. Anyway, let's get the hell out of here. Alright, so the fusion core was the only like important thing here. Of course, our companion dog meat was pretty important too. That was a good pickup. Uh, let's go ahead and head from the Red Rocket Station down into Concord. If you head over here, I think there's a Nuka Cola Quantum in this house. Not a whole lot to this place besides that, though. So, yeah, there's a door right there. Um, cap stash as well. Yep, there it is. Oh, baby. Sugar bombs. Alright, so nothing to the downstairs. Let's go ahead and check out the upstairs. Where's their bathroom? Do they even have a bathroom? Bobby pin box. That's definitely worth picking up. Bobby pin, ashtray. Um, Nuka Cola bottle. I don't want the Nuka Cola. It's radiated. I don't like it. I don't like it. Chem box. Cool. Alright, so we can go ahead and fucking. We can bounce. Bounce out of there. Discovered Concord. All right, now that we've discovered Concord, there's gonna be a lot of stuff to pick up there. Why don't we go ahead and head back to Sanctuary and drop off a bunch of shit? Sounds good, Brian. All right, let's do it. Cause now we can fast travel right back to Concord, and that makes things very easy. I'm also gonna be doing uh, side quests in and out of the main quests, so be be aware of that. Like I'm gonna be doing a main quest, and then I'll do like a side quest or two here, and then get back to the main quest. Just whatever the uh direction takes me, I guess. Alright. Let's see, what do I want to put away? Fat man. Yeah. I'll put away this extra wedding ring too. My aid. I think I wanna keep oh actually I'll put away these Nuka Cola cherries. Whoops. And the quantum, because I don't know. I don't really know what I'm gonna do need to do with them, you know? And this carrot, I'll put that carrot away too. So I don't accidentally eat it. We're gonna have to grow grow stuff later. You can put away all this stuff too, because it's not gonna do much for you. Just weigh you down a little bit. Got two fusion cores, nice. I don't even remember picking up one. Except for that one that was in the <laughs> the sewage or whatever. Um, okay, so that's cool. That's our inventory. Let's head over here. We'll craft. Break down these. We can scrap all four of these bad boys. Um, and we can scrap both of these, too. I'm about to get a new weapon, so I'm not trying to really add too much to this pistol. It's going to be an energy weapon, too, because remember, I use energy weapons. I like using energy weapons. Oh, yeah. Can I modify my armor, though? 
No, can't do shit to my armor. How good is my armor? Um, 10 damage resistance, okay. So 10, yeah. Okay, so I'll definitely get better stuff. I'm gonna need to wait till I find, like, leather pieces, though. Leather armor pieces. So now that we're done with that, we can go ahead and head over to Concord. Probably re actually remove this marker here. Alright, let's head to Concord. Back to Concord. few things to pick up here in Concord. We have the... Um, we have... Well, for, we have our first bobblehead. It's going to be in the museum. Uh, which we'll get to eventually. We also have another fusion core that we can pick up. And another magazine. Like a tattoo magazine. So you get a tattoo. Uh, and that won't be till pretty much at the end of Concord, though. Okay, so we got a couple of areas to explore while we're here. I think there's, and there are a couple of expert locked, lock level uh, chests. We'll come back and get those eventually, don't you worry. So this is going to be our first place over here. The workhouse. Not a whole lot going on in here. But we're going to want to go ahead and check it out just for its its few goodies it has. <laughs> if it's even worth it. Nah. I mean, I think it has some stuff. Um, let's get around here. I believe there's actually a office. Whoop, I did not mean to do that. Oh god, let's go up to the top. There's like an office area that has some some stuff in it. That's kind of mainly why we're here. You can also go to the top and have it serve as like a sniping post too. It serves as a really well sniping post. So this is, yeah, this is the top. Look, this is really interesting. These guys are like, he's like choking him as they died by the bombs. It's very interesting. There's like a story to those skeletons and I like it. Fucking like it. Nice. Alright, so we got that. I don't think we want anything else. If you go up there, then you can get on the rooftop. Actually, there might be an item up here, so why don't we. I'll, I'll go ahead and check it out. Pretty sure there's like a small little chest or something. Not chest, but you know what I mean. Container, there we go. That's a more appropriate word. Container. Whenever I say chest, I think this like big, like, awesome thing that's gonna have a lot of really good stuff in it. And I was completely wrong. I think it's a different... A, uh, yeah, it's totally a different... Different building. Okay, well, we did everything we want to do here. So that's good. Let's go ahead and head on down. There's a chem box right here that you can get. Psycho or a cooler, whatever. Same shit. It's all lit up over here too, I don't know why. Alright, let's go ahead and get out of here. Back to the Commonwealth. We're going to take a slight detour too. Away from the center of town. Because there's a house with medical items in it, I believe. Nothing special, no locks or anything, just medical items. Oh, that's right up here. Okay. It's really creepy. I don't know, exploring all this stuff. There's some caps. So that's good. Cram. Dirty ashtray. Subway token. I don't even know what that does. Clean black suit. Oh wow, maybe there really isn't. Oh yeah, there we go. That's what I was looking for. Okay. Nope, don't care, dog. 
There's a little playground. It's creepy, man. This is all at night. It's like, whoa. Whoa, dude. Uh, here we go. Trying to get back on track. <laughs> nice dog, get him. Get his ass. Raider chest piece. Yeah, I'm gonna take that. And the road leathers. Because that's gonna be kind of like an under garment type thing. So this is our second location. Concord uh speakeasy. We'll be in here a lot lot shorter than we were the other place. And then after that we're gonna head up to the main area and complete this quest and probably pretty much complete Concord. So, heads up. Alright. Yeah, not a whole lot going on in here. Looks like it was a bar or, or something. Some sort of tavern that people were hanging out at. And they are like, fuck it, dude. We're all gonna die. Let's just die. Pompadour wig. Plus one charisma. I like it. Cigarette. Plastic bowl. Dirty ashtray. Beer bottle. Camera. Yeah, there's a safe right there. We'll take these bowls too. All right, let's get this safe. That's it. Fragmine fuse, jet molotov, red X silver locket. Not a bad find. Plus eleven experience. All right. Oh yeah, there's like a cellar area too. Economy wonder glue. Take that gas canister, deflate kickball. Straw pillow. We're just grabbing everything. But everything can pretty much be used. Everything you can pick up has like some sort of purpose, I guess. It can be used in some some fucking some way. Alright, let's go. Is there an upstairs? I think there is, and I didn't go over here. The back area. Well, there's nothing over here anyway. Is there anything on this table? No. Cool pick, though. Alright, yeah, let's explore upstairs really quick. Maybe I, li I lied. I thought we were. I thought this place was a lot smaller. Alright, let's go about right here. Fuck! Too far, I think. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. There we go. Yes. Beautiful. Might level up twice actually by the time we get back. So there's gonna be a bunch of like ammo and stuff in here. Ooh, a leather left leg, nice. Another pistol. I don't know what's going on. I feel like my crosshair is like freaking out. Um, okay, so we were up here. So this is cool, we can head in here. If you hold B, you can uh, light up the area with a green glow, it would appear. vault Tech lunchbox. Not entirely sure. I think they're used for uh, making mines. Oh no, I didn't want to go in there. No! They're used for making mines, though, like explosive mines. You can blow people up, traps, that sort of thing. I don't do that kind of stuff, though. That ain't me. That ain't me. There's gonna be some long, like, <laughs> there's gonna be some long intervals in between completing these main quests. Let's head back in there. That was my mistake. I apologize. I did not mean to put you guys through all that waiting. I sound like Mitch Hedberg now. Um. Okay, so they died on the bed. Oh, him and a mannequin. <laughs> I thought that was a chick. That's funny. He died on the bed with a mannequin. That's funny. See, like, I like how they put, like, character into the, uh, I don't know. Here's an interesting spot. All these mannequins with, like, machetes and shit surrounding this skeleton in a tub. I thought that was pretty interesting. Alright, I think that's it. As far as all this goes, now we can exit. Yeah, I really wanted to show that. I don't know. Let's go ahead and head out the, uh, front door.
mean, there's a couple of areas. Actually, we should probably wait until we get the expert level of lock picking, which we won't hit till we're level seven. So it's gonna take a minute. Just a heads up. But we'll be coming back here. Don't worry. Oh, did he handle all these guys? I guess so. Wow. I don't want that. So yeah, this is my new weapon. Completed out of time. Ooh. And we gotta level up. I like it. Um, yeah, we're gonna wait on those. Where is that? There we go. Yes. Alright, so this weapon works where you have to press X to like reload it. Oh yeah, I gotta level up too. You press X to reload it. And then you fire and it takes that amount, like it takes two shots worth of damage. Or that's how much it deals to the enemy. Well, I just leveled up, so. Let me go ahead and do this. I don't think that we need... Oh, I'm trying to... Alright, so what I'm going to go ahead and do, normally I would get the next hacker, but I don't think we're going to run into an advanced terminal here in a little while, so I think we're cool with, yeah, we're cool with, uh, I'm going to go ahead and get the Idiot Savant, because I want to get this really early. And what it does is, the lower your intelligence, the better chance you get at having, like, extra... Um, what am I trying to say? Extra experience. There we go. That's what I'm trying to say. So yeah, you gain, uh, it, it, it's random. So the higher your intelligence, the lower of a chance you have to gain extra experience from completing an action is, I guess, the best way to, to word it. I don't know, I'm having a hard time wording it, but I, I felt like that was pretty clear. I don't know. Um, okay. Fuse screwdriver. I don't think I'm going to start that quest until... After... Because I just completed uh, whatever it was called, the, the main quest. I might end the episode before I head in there. Still thinking about it. There's a lot to explore here in Concord. This would be a good stopping point. Then we can head on in. Maybe do some other stuff. Duct tape tin can, aluminum can, anything down here? Nope, 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 okay, guess I'll head up top, go into night vision mode, essentially, nothing over there, here we go, this is what I was talking about, like with a stash up on a rooftop somewhere, is there an enemy up here at some point? I feel like there was. I don't know, let's get out of here. Let's head back down. It's all dark. I don't like it. Yeah, I got him. Okay, so there's this church right here, which has an expert, I think, level lock in it. But let's go ahead and check it out anyway. We'll be coming back here. Yeah, it has an expert lock. I already know it. I already fucking know it. Um, I don't know if I want to drop down here. Alright, well, while we're up here, we might as well, I guess, get what's up here. We can always come back later. Woo, here's a nice top view. From the church, uh, I don't know, steeple. Let's go ahead and uh, head down here. Move! Dog meat. Although his name is not dog meat. Alright, so here's the expert level chest. Or whatever, safe, whatever you want, fucking... Whatever you want to call it. I'll take those, though. I feel like that was floating. Was that Molotov cocktail floating? What's it doing? Anyway, we'll come back here. There's actually another chest in this town that we cannot get until we get the expert uh, level lockpicking skill. So it's all good. It is all good. Uh, let's go ahead and... There's another house down here we can explore. It has a bunch of stuff in it.
All the way at the end. You gotta go all the way. There we go. This beauty right here. Another small little area, but it does have a bunch of goodies. Kind of reminds me of that first place uh, that we were in before we entered. Knuckles! Yes! I've been waiting for those brass knuckles. Woo! Oh, yeah. My first unarmed combat weapon. I like it. So you get weapons really early on. Like, you know, melee weapons. Unarmed combat takes a little bit. So let's head to the top. I think there's a safe up here. There's a cap stash. We could call it bottles. Yeah, there is a safe up here. Called it. There we go. <laughs> 21 bobby pins. Doing pretty damn well on those. 95 caps. I don't think there's anything else really up here. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. Okay. So that's cool. I think that is pretty much... There is another area with a locked chest, an expert chest. You know what? Let's go ahead and do it. How much time do we have? 26 minutes in the episode? Yeah, we have some time. We haven't even broke the, the half hour mark yet. So we'll go ahead and... So that's the speakeasy right there. Let's go ahead and explore. Is it this building? I think it is. Desk fan, cap stash. Psycho corn, yeah, save that corn. Any corn you get, any carrots you get, save that shit. Take all these. There's nothing. There's gotta be something up here. Unless we go up to a higher higher level. What's on the balcony? Nothing good. Nothing actually. There's like nothing on the balcony. Um, oh no, we can't get up there. Shit. I don't think you can get up there. Let's try. Yeah, I don't know. Um, maybe this isn't the building I was thinking of. Where are we at? In relation to the... There it is. This is the building I was thinking of. This has stuff in it. Yeah, this has the expert lock. I don't know what that other building was, but I guess we got a couple items in there. This place has the uh, other expert lock, though. Uh, wonder glue. And there you go. So, anyway, we'll come back here once we unlock that next level of lock picking. We'll go ahead and get those. Let's go ahead and head over to the in front of this place. Actually, you know what? Yeah, let's head over here. I'm going to end the episode right here. Next episode, we're going to go ahead and head in here and try and... What's our next quest? Let's go ahead and check that, that out. When Freedom Calls. So yeah, we'll go ahead and take on When Freedom Calls. So I'm going to go ahead and thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. My name is Brian, and hopefully I'll see you in the next one.